Hello and welcome to episode 127. Today I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I have built a monstrosity out there for my mobs. I'm hoping when they do turn on, well I did turn them on briefly, but that did not actually help. Uh, I might need to put it on for a permanent time and see anything drops. I might make another one of these but using dripstone. Uh, um, in, in, uh, dripstone, uh, you know, the stalactites and stalactites, and literally let them drop from up there. I don't know if it's dark enough, though, but that's the only problem. It's a right eyesore, though. <laughs> but I, I can live with that. Right, in today's episode, I am going to be doing, basically, harvesting all the veg vegetables, the harvest. Because... I've still got to trade with villagers. I've got to get new villagers to be librarians because I need a silk touch and a few mending books. Because I want my armor to have mending on. Would be more ideal and beneficial for this. I will be playing some music in, in a moment. Well, I'm just saying what's happening into this episode. So, yeah, we are going to be listening to uh, Elevate again because they are a band that I've just fell in love with. I've been looking around the uh, region on YouTube and Google to find out rock bands from areas of the world where normally I just listen to rock that I know of and heard of. But I like to find bands that I've never heard of and listen to their music and I'm like okay I, I like this song or I like the uh, uh, album and I'm like okay I'll download it because I want to get to know the band as in what other songs they can do v variety of uh, regional songs like Nightwish are a operatic rock band from Finland and they are really really good I've seen them live uh, once back in 2012 and I'd love to see Nightwish again live because they are superb. Downside is though, good old Marco ain't going to be there now though with uh, the band, the bass guitarist, because he sadly left. He left last year and he's looking at new adventures for himself and props to him because, you know, he's had multiple bands. He's been, he's had his own band. He's released a few albums by himself and... I wish him the best of luck. Um, I have looked at... I was going to look at Russian uh, rock bands. But with the current situation with Ukraine. I haven't spoke about this at all in any of my videos. And I, I, I am really... Well, I'm, I'm going to say it as it is. Because I don't know back. I, I think Vladimir Putin is a fucking arsehole. And unfortunately, the Russian Grand Prix... Russian football teams in UEFA's Champions League and FIFA are punishing Russia as a whole. And I think that's actually quite wrong because it's not the sports people who are doing it. It's Putin himself. And Putin has literally fucked Russia over. We will end up in a nuclear war. But first of all, we're going to have a second Cold War. That's for certain. And I, I don't talk about politics. I, I I try not to speak about politics at all. If I can help it. Because. I have my I have my uh, opinions. And my opinions sometimes are. You know. Outdated or. PC snowflakes take offence. To what I say. You can't say that sort of thing. I'm like fuck off. Of course I can. My grandfather. Fought in the second world war for my freedom of speech. And our government takes away our freedom. Because you can't say this and you can't say that because it's PC snowflakes. Political correctness has gone mad. And I've spoke about political correctness on multiple occasions. And how I think it's just totally fucked up. Prince Philip was amazing. Because he spoke as he, as he, as he found it. Prince, Prince Philip just don't care. And that's what we should do in this world. We say what we say and we do what we do. And if you don't hurt nobody, it's always good. But everyone has an opinion. And every opinion is different. That's what makes the world go around. 
Now, if everyone had the same opinion and the same view and wearing the same clothes and so forth, the world would be a very dull place. And it would be dull. But I, I think some of the world needs to address that some some people in Russia are innocent. It's like um, terrorists, you know, come from Muslim worlds like Afghanistan and Kazakhstan and all them. But there's a small minority that are terrorists and the rest are innocent people. And that's what Russia is. It's a minority of people who follow Putin, saying Putin's right about this, this and this. When really, they, they've been a bit like North Korea, how it's all fucking propaganda. We had propaganda in World War Two, and, and we don't learn from our past mistakes. And this is history repeating itself again and again. No matter how many times you can stop a war, a war will always find a way to start. If it's not about oil or religion, it's fucking politics. And it's politics that piss me off. Because where's we are a generation that should be war free. We should be able to do what we should do in life and be happy. And our leaders of this world think they're better than everybody else and think the rules don't apply to them. Now, like I said, I, 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 it's cool. I, I did history for my GCSEs and I'm going way back now, over 20 years. And I love history because history can tell us what went on, why shit went down. But do you know what the most bizarre thing is? We just never fucking learn. We don't stop to think about the consequences of people. Like people in Afghanistan and Kazakhstan and Iran, Iraq. You know, people had to flee their homes because it was war in torn countries. And that's what fucking Putin's doing to the Russians. And it, it's just totally wrong. And like I said, I, I very rarely talk political on this channel. I, I try to keep my views out of all this stuff. Same like how Boris Johnson's fucked up the country. With fucking the pandemic. And people are saying he should resign, he should do this, he should do that. You know, he will resign. And when that shit hits the fan, that's when that's when you'll see him will walk. He will walk until he's until he has to. And instead of the pandemic now being top priority in the news and volcanoes and other stuff that are hitting this world currently. We've already done one war. The war on terrorists. We've already lived through that. And now we're going to live through another war. A war with bloody Russia. And I feel like I said, I'm going to feel sorry for the people in Russia. Who are innocent. Who don't agree with Putin. It's them people I feel sorry for. Because they have got a say. And their say does not count for nothing. Because if you don't follow a leader. You're against them. You get fucking killed. Simple as. Propaganda, propaganda in North Korea. I guarantee you right now, if 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 America and England and some of the other countries that get involved with Russia, we will end up having, like that, having a nuclear war. And this is this will now turn out to be Fallout, the game Fallout. This is how it will be. We'll be living in bunkers underground for thousands of years while the fucking radiation on the land. Kills everything, mutates everything. It, 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 you think I'm joking, but it, 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 it's a joke. It's serious. We will end up like a video game. The video game is always based off something. 
fiction, non-fiction, but it's happening, and it's true. What goes down will come around. I just hope we can stop Putin before he does anything too too serious. Because if if a war breaks out, that 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 that's it. The world's over because Korea's got fucking nukes, America's got nukes, England ain't got no nukes. There's a lot of countries who ain't got nukes, but that's what will happen. And that's guaranteed. And I feel sorry for our kids who are literally seeing this for the first time. Like I said, we had a Cold War in the 70s or 80s with Russia. When it used to be known as USSR. And I think that's what Putin wants. He wants the USSR back. And that's what annoys me. Right there. Let's get this achievement for the uh, for the block. Um, stop that there. Okay, and where's my axe? Hey. And if I do that and then do that, oh, I can't get the. Have I got the achievement already? Then. I think I've already got the achievement. Alright, I think I've already got the achievements. I'll have to have a look. I don't want to do these, but... Go on, get in there. <laughs> right, that's all that I harvest. Right, let's put all this away. I, I need... More storage. I've got a lot of sugar cane. Way more sugar cane than I expected. Right, let's drop that in there. Let's do that. Let's do that with the potatoes. Alright, can I do anything down in this one? Come on. I can't do that, can't do that, can't do that, can't do that. Can't do honeycomb. Can't do anything in that one. I can do melon in this one. God, I'm doing carrots. Got more carrots there. Can't do beets. Anything in here for seeds? No, no seeds. Let's, let's, let's look at this one. Seeds are maxed out. Oh, carrots. There we go. Uh, that dog needs to sit down. Uh, I've got bread. Wheat. More wheat. Um, honey bottles. Baked potatoes. Um, okay, it looks like this chest is, oh god almighty, this chest is running out. Um, oh bloody hell. Uh, okay, I need to think. I need to think long and hard where I'm going to put all this. I've got, I got poisonous potatoes for no apparent reason. But this, this is really starting to affect my, uh, Stuff, books, wood. I will need another chest. Um, I don't really want to make, keep making double chests, but I've got no choice. Um, I've got no. I ain't got no chest. Oh yeah, I've got four. I've got four chests. Okay. Uh, let's do that. Right, let's move. Let's move this cat. Right, do that. There we go. Can I? I oh god. Um, this is why I didn't want double chests. Actually, this barrel can be moved, I suppose. Right, okay, that barrel can move. Right, I can go there. Uh, this barrel. Actually, that barrel can go over the uh, thingy, Carney. Can I do that? It can. Oh, I know what I can do. Can I make anything on here? Can I make any carpets? 
Oh, I need two pink wool to make carpets. Hmm. Okay. Let's... Let's make this a little bit more neater down here then. Let's go. Right. Okay. First things first. So let's... Let's do this. I'll leave the poisonous potatoes in there for now. I, I'm not really rushing about too much. I've got shears. I've got pink dye. I've got, I haven't got pink dye, have I? Oh, these, these eggs can be moved as well now. Since I've just made a double chest. Warp on the fungus can go there. That can go there. That can go there, I suppose. Right. Here we go. There we go. Look at that. Nearly filled another chest of food. Right. I need some uh, shears because I am going to have to do this. Oh, more eggs! <laughs> I've got, I've got to stop. I've got to do something about these eggs because they just keep growing. The eggs just keep multiplying. I've got so many chucks; it's unreal. I love it though because it's a chuck farm. Hey, I got pink sheep. Then I died. Of oh, I did. Oh, I could have dyed the other, other shape though, other colours. Oh, it, it, it just gave me some more wool. Mind you though, I can, I can dye the, uh, the wool. Um, I've got black, I think. I've got black insects. I've got insects. That's a good question, actually. I've got insects. I've got to jump up and over. <laughs> right, do that. No, I've got four there. That gives me some pink. Right, what colours have I got? Have I got anything at all? I have got insects, right. Let's use two. Because I don't actually know. There we go. That, that, that gives me that. That gives me six of that. Um, that gives... That gives me three of them. i got nine white. I don't really want white wool if I can help it. I want multicoloured wool. Let's do... And then let's do... Let's do that. Okay, I want to make this a little bit more... I don't, I don't know, what, I don't know what kind of word I want. Uh, oh god, I've still got some pink. I don't know I had pink left. There's me dropping pink down. I'm like, ah, hey. Oh, really, game? Really? Really? Right. Okay, it's pink. Uh, yellow. And I need some bone meal. Let's use that five. Right. Up and over, up and over. Right, yellow. On these bad boys. Red. On these bad boys. Right, let's make... I could also make orange, actually. I made white, white dye. Why have I made white? And I want to make... I don't know, I don't make... Uh... I can make orange. Right, there we go. So, let's go and rock and roll. Oh gosh, beehives are full again. Where's, where's my shears? Oh, there they are. Come on, you. Come in there. Good. I'll try not to kill them if I can help it. I can always rebreed them. That, that's one thing I can always do. Is breed. Actually, can I do? I can do that. I can do that. That's two of them. I need two red, don't I? Uh, I need. I need. And I need. Oh, I need more yellow. And I need. So I need one yellow. Um. Oh, darn it! Make another one of them. Right, I can hear the bees, man. It's great. Can't believe I end up using white dye. That gives me three of them. Orange? No, I need to make another orange, don't I? Um, hmm. I need I need a little bit more bone meal. I should have really. Uh, Use the composters to make bone meal, but I ain't gonna grumble at the moment because 
I made the wrong die at the wrong time. Right, I want one of you. So I want to make red die. I can make orange. I can make orange die. I want to make one. Let me guess. I made two, didn't I? Make one of them. That makes that. I need one more red. All right, let's make some red. Uh, let's make another one of them. Let's craft that. Boom! All these hives? Yeah, all them hives are looking good. Uh, like I said, I will have to uh, repopulate the bees. Because I, I did kill a couple when I tried to knock them back into the hives. Over the last few days, so I, I do now. Hmm. Hmm. I need more wool. I want more wool. I want more dye. Hey, that boy, boy's got some wool. Oh, so that was the pink one. Hey. Oh my god, I've got more eggs. I come away with 12 more eggs, 15 more eggs, oh wow, no, nearly two stacks of eggs, I'll say it's two stacks, there's only a stack of 16, so yeah, that, that's kind of cool, right, this is funny, there we go, right, I've got pink, I need to wait for that pink one to hit uh, a thingy again, oh, I've got a honeycomb here as well, I need to double check my honey uh, thingy. Right, I can make some more red carpets. That, that's kind of cool. That makes two. Right, I've only got one orange. One orange die. I need to make two orange. Put a red there. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I need eight. Eight. I need eight. Uh, now what? Now what? Now what? I'll use a little bit more bone meal. Let's make another orange dye. Why not? Why not just make another orange dye? I, I wish I could uh, do the blue. Hmm. I wonder if there is a way of doing blue. I I have to I have to uh. I have to destroy one. Do you know what? Let's make some blue dye. Let's let's get two. Because I need I need to craft two. Two. Turn that to three. Right. Um let's see I, I I can easily just go bow mill. I need yellow. Bow meal. Oh god, that, 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 that's done. That one's done. Sorry, bees. I thought I did all the hives. I do apologise. Right, there, there you go. Uh, that, that's up there, is it? No, I collected it right. Okay, let's craft. And craft. And craft. Craft one of them. Right. Uh I'll do two orange. That gives me six. I need. Hmm. What do I need? I thought I did wax copper block. Do I need to do it on the oxidized one? Hmm. I might need to put it on the oxidized one. Um, hmm. Right, let's put these carpets down. And then I'll work out what other colours I want because this this is kind of cool. It's only a way. Yeah, that red needs to be moved to blue. Bl uh, blue there. Uh, blue there. And then I suppose I could have orange, orange, orange. Then I just need two colours. Do you know what? Sorry, I'm gonna just craft white. There we go. 
Eh, colourful floor, I suppose. Right. I've got dyes and I've got carpets that I don't need. I've got an orange colour. Uh, yellow. Pink. Uh. Ah. Uh, can I not make an orange? Oh, I can. Hey, hey. Orange. I've got orange. Let's just double check. Pink, black, blue, yellow, red. Orange. Hey. And can I, can I, can I, can I put that on you? Can I not put that on you? Okay. Okay. Uh. Do I die the? Oh my god! I just died the water orange. Um. Hmm. Can I? Can I actually do this? Is this even possible? Oh god, the cat's on the box. Come on, you. Come on. Uh. Oh, fish. <gasps> He's just moved. Right, there we go. Hey! I have got bottles. Hey! There you go. That's how you sort the water out. <laughs> Comes in handy. Right, I've got white dye and I've got white carpet. Right. Let's, uh Let's burn this quickly. Right, that needs to go there. Right. Do that. Jobs are good. In. Right. That's the harvest done. I do like these glow berries. These, these glow berries really do come in handy. I still don't know what's going on with this one over here. Because this one hasn't grown. I don't know why. I, there's nothing obstructing it really. I, I just don't understand. Maybe the trees in the way. I, I I don't know why this one isn't growing, but I will do that. And can I do that? Hey, right. Um, let's take. Oh no, I've just broke that. I didn't want to break that then. It's all good. It'll grow back. There we go. Now it's growing. Maybe, I don't, I, like I said, I don't understand why that one hasn't grown and this one has. I can't harvest this, can I? Can I? Can I? I've tried, I think, I, no, I can't. I've tried to, I've tried to and no. Right, okay, that, that's cool. Right. At least I've got glow berries on. Right, let's, um, let's turn night to day and then I'll end the video. So it's just been, uh, harvest. Harvest everything. Get a couple of dyes for the floor, because as you can see, I've done up here really with a mixture. I then did here with a, well mainly white and a bit of red and a bit of blue, but then down here, I went for a deep different colour scheme. <laughs> I think if I do this properly, I can make the floors look really nice, but I, I don't really care too much. I've got a new idea in mind. I need to speak to a uh, a few people. It's going to be uh, Empire uh, SMP style thinking about doing because even now here I've done everything but kill the dragon. I know where the uh, never. I know where the fortress is. The downside is though I can't find a never fortress, and I don't know where one is in my world. I know I could make a new portal. And the portal could could give me the location of a fortress. But I, I am thinking of getting a few people on and do Empire's SMP but my own spin on it. And that's something that I am looking forward to. Because I haven't been able to move the villagers here because Claire has been on to give me a helping hand with that. This world will still be played when I'm not doing the Empire-esque videos. Um, there's a lot of people I need to ask. There's about eight people in total I need to ask. And there's about... There's, 
there's about four people I can ask to join straight away and then it just comes down to if they want to do it with me because it's great having the ideas it's, it's great having the name of the night name of the uh, episodes and so forth and yeah I'd create a new world make a new spawn everyone then spawns on there I'd tell them the rules and regulations uh, and so forth but that's in the pipe work I did tweet uh, Flip and ask him if I could uh, do it. Unfortunately, Flip did not reply to me, so I I will tweet him once again if I have to, because it is going off his uh, videos and his and his uh, creation in a way, because Empires was his creation. I am doing my own spin on it. It's, it's going to be called something different. But I do want Fripp's approval. Because. It would mean so much to me. That I could do the videos. And. It would be more entertaining than just. Doing on peaceful. This would be. Uh, maybe normal or easy. Uh, mobs. And it will be. Thoroughly. Thoroughly played. It will be once a week. For everybody, it would be a Sunday uh, video sort of thing. P published on me on a Monday. Because, as you know, I do my videos a day or a night time. And then post them the following day. That's how I do all my videos. Because I do so many videos. I play FIFA live. Even though it doesn't sound like I do it live. <laughs> But yes, yeah, the only game I do live every every day is FIFA. All the others are pre-recorded and, and then published the following day. As I'm as I'm doing FIFA, I do post FIFA videos first, and then whatever video I fancy to post next will be posted next. Uh, and that, so yeah, that that's why I do what I do. I do over 16 videos a day, and that's a lot of videos for a channel, but. People don't like FIFA, they might like other content on my, on my uh, channel. Some people might just watch the Formula 1 videos. So I'll be. My, I, I like to have a variety on my channel because that's something that a lot of people don't do really. And that's variety. And it's like the same old, same old then. Day in, day out, week in, week out. It's the same sort of content. And yeah, people can get pretty bored of the same old content. I know this... This at the moment is peaceful slash survival uh, builds, but this took, like I say, three episodes, maybe four episodes to build. I didn't plan it. I just, I just sort of like went along with it and thought, yeah, okay, I'll build it. I know it does work. It does kill mobs. I've tested it on my uh, copied world. I don't know if mobs are going to spawn up there. That's one thing I'm going to have to do. Set up an a AFK farm at the top. Or stay around this area. When mobs are on. Just to see if they do drop down. Because if they don't drop down. That means then the roof's too tall. Or it's too bright. I ain't sure. If I've, I know I've built it right. I just don't know if. This part. The ones that hang out are the same. If they're right, I know the water's right because like I said, I had to test that, and that was the uh, main concern was the water being enough blocks along to push them down into the campfires. So that, like I said, that's one thing I I, I had to uh, test, and I used uh, Pixel Rift and Gemini Tay um, style esque builds, uh, Pixel Rift semi build one similar on his um, survival guide and I took inspiration from both both um, content creators and yeah I, that's why I say it's not my design it's two designs rolled into one so yeah I don't take I don't take people's creations and say yeah they're my own when they're not I take my own spin on stuff but the uh, premise, or whatever it's called, is of two people. But 
I am going to end this video. Uh, where shall I end this video? Um, somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. On a drip leaf now, because drip leaf will drop me down into the water. Uh, why is this bit not growing? And then that bit has. That makes no sense. Uh, yeah, right. Okay, I'm going to say. Oh, I've lost my helmet. Oh, God, all my armor needs repairing. Oh, no. My aqua. Oh, aqua infinite. I've lost my Aqua Infinity helmet. Oh, fuck. I need to repair all this. Oh, fuck. I've lost my helmet. And I don't think I've got another Aqua book, have I? Give me a second. I don't think I have. Oh, this is why I need villagers. Pardon me, this is why I need villagers to have my uh, stuff. Oh no, I'm gonna have to fish one up, aren't I? Let's double check. Bone. Uh, efficiency, curse of energy, and oh, say efficiency, sharpness, might, piercing, piercing. Oh no, 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 no. Infinity, blast, feather fall. Fuck! I don't even notice. Oh, should have repaired, man. Right, let's repair my stuff first. I might not even have enough to uh, repair them. I've got 12 enchantment levels. 12. This is going to take more than 12. This is going to take more than 12. 13. You are kidding me. 13 levels. You are kidding me. That's going to cost 5. And that's going to cost 13. So tomorrow I'm going to have to fish. That is guaranteed tomorrow's episode is fishing. So there's going to be nothing but fishing tomorrow. I don't believe that. I don't believe it. So, yeah, I'm a little bit annoyed about that. Oh, it's because that cat's on there, isn't it? Right, let's move you across. You depth stride that. See, that, that would have been good. Oh, I don't believe it. And look at that, I had an helmet as well ready. Oh, I'm annoyed, I'm annoyed, I'm annoyed at myself. I just don't believe I did that. That, to me, is just sad. Right, let's get some fish. Have I got any fish in here? Cooked. I've got raw. That's a good question. Have I got raw? I have, I've got raw card. Right, you two. No, don't make a baby. Right, you two, come here. Come here. Aha! Right, you sit there. You can sit up there. Right, now I'm happy. Now I'm happy. Right. <laughs> yeah, I had to use a bit of bit of rawness there. Uh, yeah. It's all good. So, tomorrow, that's what I need. I just don't believe it. I just lost my best helmet. Ah, oh, I'm so annoyed. This is why it pays dividend to actually have armour. Uh, and pay attention to it. But I, again, just... I dial up properly. Right, let's end the video. I, I'm just... I'm a spoon. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Right. I don't care about the beehives. They they can be done in another in another episode. Do you know what? Let's let's stand let's stand here. Right. Look at that. I'm gonna say thank you very much for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, hit that bell for notifications, and tomorrow we will be doing some fishing. And until then, I will see you all again. Goodbye.